protest at a local Target after three black teens say they were racially profiled, detained by security despite having done nothing wrong. It was all captured on video. Eyewitness News reporter Leanne Suter is live in Westlake Village with more as the mother of one of the boys demands change. Leanne. Veronica, the teens say they committed no crime. Their attorney says that they are now filing suit, claiming that they were targeted simply because of their race. Protesters rally outside this target in Westlake Village demanding justice after three black teens were wrongfully accused of shoplifting by store security and detained by L.A. County Sheriff's deputies. They don't deserve to be treated that way. They deserve to be treated like a human being and they have rights as a citizen and that their rights should not be violated. The incident captured on camera by the teens. The group says a store employee blocked the door with a shopping cart, saying they couldn't leave after another group of teens were seen shoplifting. Malik Aaron, Gregory Kim, and Aaron Fredrickson say the deputies who then detained them became aggressive. Target issued an apology and pledged to retrain all senior employees. This is not an isolated incident. This is not gonna be the last and it surely was not the first. And so we need more than just an apology. The teen's attorney says they've received numerous complaints from other customers of similar discrimination at the store. Their group is demanding a meeting with corporate executives to talk about racial bias and are asking people to boycott Target. The teen's parents say the boys were traumatized by the troubling encounter. We're asking for change. We want change from the top all the way down. And we want accountability, not just for our kids, but for the other kids that come into these stores. And the teen's attorney says that they will be filing civil suits against Target as well as the L.A. County Sheriff's Department. Live 